Hello, Spiral Scout team is speaking. In today's quick tutorial, we're going to review how the Roadrunner passes the HTTP request to one of your application workers, then receives the HTTP response and passes it back to the client computer or browser. Before we're going to start, it is important to remember how the Roadrunner works. It sits between the client computer and your application in a form of PHP workers, receives the request from these applications, map it into internal format, which is currently PSR7, uh, and then executes by your application. Roadrunner uses a single worker to execute a single request, as you can see on the screen. So this means that you don't need to worry much about concurrency or uh, accessing the same variables from different workers. Inside the HTTP worker we created, all you have to do is to define an infinite loop or main loop of your application. This loop is intended to receive the request via Roadrunner using the method wait request and then provide the response using method respond. You can provide responses in a form of error codes, you can provide responses in a form of uh, binary payloads, string payloads, and so on. In fact, you can use any compatible PSR7 implementation. You can also catch errors, exceptions, log them, or map them into the nice looking exception page. Once the response has been generated, it's been passed back to the Roadrunner and been mapped back to the client computer. 